Hello. We will be showing you how to create a gift registry for an existing customer, process payments from an existing registry, and view an updated registry. First, click on the Point of Sales tab at the top. Go to New Sales Order. Next to Status, use the drop down to select Registry. Begin to enter in the numbers associated with the item. You can adjust the quantity by clicking on the line and pressing the quantity button. If you happen to select too much, you can adjust that as well. When you finish with that, you would go down and type in the last name of the customer in the customer info box. Once you have found the customer, select it, their information will pop up and you will press save only. To view the registry, you would go back to gift registry press F, type in the last name, hit search, select the customer, accept, find registry, and now you can see the registry. Next we will show you how to process payments from that registry. When a patron comes in to purchase items from an existing registry, you would go to the Point of Sales tab and drop down to Sales Order List. In the Find Sales Order box, you would type in the last name of your customer, hit this button. When you find the name, select Sales Order. I want to drop down to Sell Items. Highlight the line with the item that you would like you can adjust the quantity for how many they like to purchase and press continue. From here you see that the person whose registry it is is at the top. If the customer chooses to leave it that way, then you just process the payment and go from there. However, if they would like for their name to be left so that the customer knows who purchased the item, Then you would type their name in, press save, the name has changed, and you're done. If a customer wanted an update on their registry, you would select Gift Registry, the F button, type in their last name, hit search, when you've selected their name, press Accept, Find Registry, and now you can see an update on the registry. You can see that this customer purchased items and the quantity in which they purchased the items, and that's the updated registry.